Hey guys, welcome back. I'm here to talk to you today about this ARC or R tower bar for the my M2 competition. This is a rear upper strut or tower bar. This is from Japan. It's aluminum with a small carbon fiber uh, overlay baked in for added rigidity and strength. It's a good little piece. Um, I've gotten this from Japan via a third party uh, buyer for me. Pretty cool experience. Um, so I'll go ahead and uh, install this, kind of show you a little overview. And if you have any questions about purchasing the bar or installing in your M2 or M2 competition, feel free to leave me a comment down below. So we remove the rug. I say you're gonna just, you're gonna take these push tabs. You're just gonna pull them out. One, two, three, four. Then we're gonna go ahead and just pull this up. It just takes a little bit of an angle to pull this. Up. this here it's pretty almost ready to go you got to get ready for the sides so what we're gonna do is we're gonna move the seats forward here in a moment we're gonna pull this clip here on this side this clip here on the right side um, and then we'll make sure to kind of wiggle this rug out of the way and it comes out in one piece it's pretty straightforward um, and then I'll show you that here in a moment once you move the seats forward and there's a tab there and on the right side as well there's a tab right here this was that dirty um, that you'll have to get out and then we'll be able to remove both sides of these uh, covering carpets on this side here keep in mind there's a cable behind this um, power adapter so you'll have to just kind of slightly pull that as you pull it off hi guys just want to show you here that there are two more uh, sockets or little pops to take off here on the left side on the top and you see here on the right as well I just tried to pull this off I almost um, broke the road there so uh, ripped it so make sure you pull that out this is on the left side I discussed that there is a socket and all you gotta do is just kind of wiggle this out you see the prongs there and it just comes out just just wiggle it out be very slow and just kind of give it like a good force uh, straight back. Okay guys, now that this is exposed, we can see the points where we're gonna attach our uh, ARC strut bar. So here on the left, you see the four points there. On the right, you see the points there. We're gonna reuse those screws. Um, not sure what kind of screws they are. 
uh, but I'll put that down in the description as well once I figure it out and you'll see me kind of take them apart here in a moment. So here we go. <clears throat> I've removed the two pieces. And this is what would normally hold this in place here. You can see it. Now, this is a pretty thin, um, it looks like a stamp metal, really thin piece that's kind of bracing those two ends of the chassis there. As opposed to look how much thicker and nicer this one looks. It's really thick billet aluminum. So I think that by itself, this bracing piece by itself is better than what's OEM. And the fact that then it's gonna also attach it in another axis, you know, across the chassis, uh, uh, over the, the struts here, it's gonna uh, be a double benefit just from seeing the quality of this stamped metal that they use for uh, that bracing there. The next step is obviously when you put the panel back in, the rug panel back in, these are going to have to kind of come through. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to measure the distance from here to here, this distance here, and then I'll measure this distance and I'm going to take it from here mark it and kind of cut it on this side and see how that works i'm hoping to get it pretty close obviously i don't want to have it be really ugly and then have to buy this whole piece this whole piece probably will not be cheaper online it'll be pretty expensive i bet here you can see the cuts so what i've done is i've measured this should be about a length about one inch in length that distance down, so I just kind of cut these. This is a Milwaukee kind of single blade. Any single blade is Acto knife. Maybe something a little bigger than an Exacto knife. Cut this out, and then we'll see if that uh, allows it to come through. You see, it's pretty clean. You're not even going to be able to tell that happened. These are just some marks, but I can clean that off here in a second.
Alright guys, there you have it. The ARC rear upper strip bar. I've showed you the inside, the outside. Here it is about the foot back. Car, my GoPro. Man, super chill. You can't even tell anything's wrong with it. Um, as far as I felt, super clean cool look. It just looks insane. Um, highly recommend. Uh, I'll leave more stuff on the comments for you guys, okay? Thanks for watching. Don't forget, like and subscribe, okay? Thanks. Bye.